Good morning, church. I trust that you, you were encouraged and challenged by our worship service, which was posted on our website and on Facebook yesterday. Well, it's now Monday morning, March 30th, and as I begin the week, I'm, I'm reminded from Romans chapter 12, verse 5, that I don't belong to myself. Paul says in verse 5, he says, So in Christ we, though many, form one body, and each member belongs to all the others. Now my love and adoration to God for the mercies that he's poured out in my life are to be shared with those around me. I am being called today to worship him by presenting my body to be used to love those around me. I don't know about you, but my tendency is to think about those who are out there, outside my home, when my true and proper worship begins in my home. One of the most humorous humorous videos that was posted this past week regarding the COVID-19 uh, crisis, it went something like this. A husband, he's being interviewed and he's asked, now if you were given a choice about your quarantine, which would you prefer, A or B? A, to be quarantined at home with your wife and child, or B, and the husband, he quickly interrupts with his answer, B, B, definitely B. Love, you know, it, it begins at home. It's where we let our hair down and tend to be most real. It's also where we tend to take for granted those who are most precious to us. I'm thinking that not only is this a time when our children are to be homeschooled, but all of us are being homeschooled. But the primary course is not math or science. It's entitled Love 101. And the curriculum involves how you care for and lay down your life for your spouse and your children. This week, let's look at our master teacher, Jesus Christ, as he sets the pattern for us as to how to worship. Enjoy each day and those whom God has placed around you. This is Pastor Bob. God bless.